I purchased a product the other day. Yes, it is a product. It is three cell phone camera lenses. And I predict that this is going to be quite of a bad one because it costed two euros. So let's open it and I'm gonna test it in this video. This is supposed to be a fisheye and I think that it is fail. This is like a wide lens and that is the macro which is probably for extremely close detail as you saw in this uh, miniature that I painted. Is that cool? What do you think? So, okay, okay, let's remove everything. This, this video is not about uh, the smartphone camera lenses. I am disappointed as I expected when I purchased them, but the last one could be handy for um, taking good pictures of eBay listings. I believe for minor details but anyways this video is not about camera lenses I'm gonna say a few words okay free cards by email plus Yu-Gi-Oh monster shot so I, I guess that you got the point we have more free cards by email from Yu-Gi-Oh monster shot and we have 36 Sun and Moon booster packs have not opened booster packs for quite a long time but now it's the time and I'm going to open them I mean super fast. I, I'm going to go speed like speed, okay? Speed. So, a reverse is a uh, DC, DC Dui. I'm not sure about this card. And the first rare is a Laguna GX. Nice and awesome pull in the very first pack. Super duper duper excited about that, but I am going to keep going because, oh come on, because I want to go fast. Uh, I don't want to keep you a lot because this is going to be a huge video if I do. So reverse color rare card of a to two cannon, whatever, and the rare is a Dragonite color rare card. A nice one, I like this line. I like this Dragonair, Dragonair, uh, Dratini Dragonair, Dragonite line. This specific one is quite cool. We have a Ratata, a, Lol a Lolan Ratata, and the rare is an Incineroar. A card that I do like in the GX form, but not in the normal one. But that's still fine. And we have a Firo reverse, and the rare is another, another, yes, another Laguna GX. Nice. Second one in a, in the same uh, booster packs. Very cool. Very cool. You know, I cannot get the proper excitement when I'm opening packs fast, but it's okay. We have a Poliwag, and the rare is a Butterfree. Okay, okay, why not? Battle free. Why not? Reverse color rare card of a Decidui and the rare is another battle free. Okay, now you have to stop popping up in my face, battle free. I don't like you so much. Uh, we have a Diglett, a Lolan Diglett, and the rare is a Tsarina, uh, maybe? River. Uh, actually, it's a color rare card. Nice. So, two DX cards already. Ah, and that's cool. 36 packs of Yu-Gi-Oh! Monster, are you freaking kidding me? You will definitely find uh, the link for his channel in the description of this video and in the card, which is probably gonna be here. I'm not sure, here or here, in any of those two points. And the rare is another Butterfree, three Butterfrees. Dude, if I get one more Butterfree, if that was an actual card, I would, I would uh, rip it, but I cannot. So if I get another Butterfree, I'm going to give it away. Have a Alolan's back, that's a holder rare card, which is a good one. And I like not reading all the cards. What do you think about that? I'm, I'm not gonna read all the cards. And we have a sweet. And the rare is a bra Braxif Braxish? Maybe? I have marked this card for review, so that means that I found something interesting in this one, but which I cannot remember. And the rare is a Parasect. I like Parasect because it is a, a classic Pokemon, but I would prefer something better, like a Lurantis, Lurantis DX. Full art, I believe? No, it's not a full art, just a DX. Good, nice. Moving on, moving on. Three DXs so far, let's see how many we can get. I want five, or maybe six. I'll have a, that, that thing, I cannot even pronounce this thing. I cannot even freaking bother to pronounce that. All right, a rainbow energy and the rare is a this thing. I'm not gonna pronounce everything because I'm gonna mess up my words and I don't want this to happen. 
Uh, Rotom Dex, that's cool. And Cosmo M, which is a rare. Uh, surprisingly, yes, because it has to evolve to the um, uh, to, to the DX one. And the rare is another one of these things that I, I refuse to pronounce. We have 19 more packs, if I saw correctly. Reverse of an or Oranguru, which is a cool card in my opinion. And a Tauros DX! Mm, uh, full art? No. No, that, that's not the full art. In the, in the beginning, I didn't... Actually, almost every DX card, I feel like it's a full art. Because it is, to be honest. It is. But it's not the full art, you know, whatever. Uh, but Taurus GX in the beginning, I didn't think that it would be such a good card. And it is, especially with Ninja Boy, this whatever card. So you fill it up with damage counters. Actually, your opponent fills it, fills it up with damage counters. And you just surprise, switch it, and yeah, you deal quite a lot of damage that way. And that's a good way to play Taurus DX. And we are in the DX counter in number 4. But I guess that we're gonna get at least one more. So my prediction for 5 would should probably be true. Reverse of this one, Stutland. And oh, a funny pool after so freaking long. I don't get funny pools so often lately. So a good one. I like this. I like funny pools. Uh, okay, okay. Oh, this is my third Cosmem in this video. Come on, buddy. Give me something better, please. We have a reverse of another uh, of a dog drio. That's actually my first dog drio and the cloister. All right. All right. Okay. And an Incineroar again. 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 And we have a Primarina. Primarina. All right. Give me something. Just, just awaken the excitement again, please. A Cloister Reverse and a Parasect. Boring card. Boring card, coin flips and stuff. I don't like such things. I don't like to depend on luck. Reverse of a Masquerade and the rare of a Cloister. Come on, one more. One more Pokemon GX. And I believe that we're gonna be in the counter of five or six. A, this thing. Eight more packs. We are close to the end. I like this speed booster pack opening. Have a Beware and a Masquerade. Seven to go. Come on. Spiro and a two two cannon. Two two cannon? You tell me. I don't know English, as you probably already noticed. A Psyduck and a Masquerade, please. Please. I hate this this is one of the things that I hate. When cards repeat themselves and when they are not DXs or uh, you know something crazy. Why do they repeat themselves if they are not crazy? <laughs> Why? Okay, battle free. That's oh, I'm gonna trade the battle free. So create a trade, and I'm gonna trade it because I said if I open one more, I'm gonna trade it. Okay, for free, right? Uh, Trina, just give me a basic energy or something. I don't want battle freeze anymore. All right, so two packs to go. Come on, come on, give me one more. Beware, last pack. Oh my God, come on, you can do it. Please give me a Pokemon DX and I will be happy to go. And it is a. No, it's another two, two cannon. A Pokemon that I cannot pronounce. So, anyways. Mm, Alright. I'm happy with the pulls. I believe that we pulled good cards. Speaking of Pokemon DXs. But I don't think that we pulled enough Pokemon DXs for 36 booster packs. 36 booster packs. Those Pokemon DXs were not um, not many. But anyways, thank you so very much, Yu-Gi-Oh! Monster Shot. Once again, you supported my channel. I really do appreciate that. Uh, you will find the link for his channel both in the description and in the cards. Definitely go check him out. He's a very, very good uh, supporter of the channel. And he's also making YouTube videos, so you definitely have to check him out. So that was another free cards by email from Yu-Gi-Oh! Monster Shot. And until next time, I really hope that you enjoyed this video. I would suggest not buying those things, um, especially if you're planning to use them for your back camera. Uh, they are probably good for the front camera. 
uh, but you may get a crazy good interesting pouch.